It was a fairly large bunch which started this most exciting of races, especially among the fans who watched on eagerly to see how riders desperately tried to avoid being caught by the devil as they sprinted after every other lap. Eventually, they would come down to the last three with the talented Akil Campbell still in the mix against two powerful Canadians and all to race for. And he needed all his experience to stay out of harm's way and to set up a head-to-head -head with Derek Guy, the man who defeated him in the scratch race. But this time, Campbell proved too strong for his Canadian opponent and held on for dear life to snatch an incredible win with Guy having to settle for second this time around. Canada's Michael Foley was third and Kemper Roscoe finished fourth among the last two to be eliminated. The women's carrying held keen interest as well, with TNT's Dominic Lavelle in the mix, but up against some tough cookies from around the world. Sarah Ferrara of Finland took matters into her own hands just after the Gurnley exited the track, as she laid on a marker and challenged the others to play catch-up. And by the time they got Bell, she was still out front, hoping to stay away. But Canada's Amelia Walsh took up the challenge and quickly roped her in to go on to win the event with an impressive and well-timed ride with Mexico's Paola Verdugo placing second and Jamaica's Delia Palmer in third. Meanwhile, in the demanding 100 lap points race event around the stadium track, the riders were hammering out a good rhythm, waiting to sprint for crucial points. Heatwave's Marco Geese liked his chances out front and rode there for a while as the others were saving their legs for the bell lap. That would come every so often and things changed drastically as the riders sprinted. Here, it was Canada's Derek Geek taking the win and some crucial points as he stretched his advantage with another five points. But he wasn't done yet as he and young Kemper Roscoe of TNT kept the tempo high as they beat a hasty trail with double points on offer on this final lap. There it was Guy leading them out as he went for it all despite holding a comfortable points advantage. But he couldn't sustain as the Bajan bullet in Jamolisman found that little extra to surge past Guy and went out to take it with TNT's Akil Campbell in hot pursuit but having to settle for second. The overall winner was the Canadian wonder kid in Derek Guy who did his work at the most critical stages. Ruskin Mark, C Sports Extra.